Hey everybody, Polish Pete, and I'm here in our bar and studio in Gold Valley, Minnesota, and we added some more Z-Man. We as you probably noticed, we've ordered a lot of Z-Man this spring. We've, we're, we're not stopping anytime soon. They keep shipping us more stuff. We're going to take it right now. So I'm excited about the ones we just got in stock currently because there's some good smallmouth stuff in here, even some cold water stuff. So perfect timing and perfect for a guy like me. Uh, first up is the Pro Craw. So... Obviously the TRD Craw's got a ton of attention and they caught them really good, so they made a big giant version of it. So this is gonna get your big bite. Uh, there's obviously a lot of applications for this. It could be just fished on you know, a, a regular jig head and just fished like a TRD. Uh, it could be fished on the back of a jig. It could be Texas rig, Carolina rig. You could do a whole bunch of different stuff with this. It looks like a real craw, but, and it floats up just like a real claw, craw. That's obviously the advantage of this Elastec material. One, it lasts forever and you can't rip this stuff up and you catch multiple fish on it. And the other thing is it floats and it floats good. It'll float up a pretty big hook. So, and with these big bulbous claws on here, this thing will stand straight up and down and look like a real, real life craw. Next up is the bat wings, jig trailers. The, these, so this looks like your traditional chunk style bait, but in Elastec. Now, chunk style bait shine in cold water presentations when you're not looking for an extreme amount of action out of your bait you're looking at those chunk style trailers you see a lot of tournament anglers use them in that pre-spawn condition and late in the fall uh tough bites things like that the chunk style trailers uh, have a big home uh, in river systems and this one here is basically going to stand straight up and down and you're going to be able to fish one of them all day long I like the fact that it's flat on the bottom, so it's going to skip like a dream. So if you're looking to skip some jigs around some cold water docks this spring, check out the bat wings. Next up is the TRD Bugs. This thing's actually really cool in person. I was kind of looking at it like, why would I want the smallest beaver ever in the history of the world? But this thing's actually pretty cool. Uh, this thing would be killer on the new micro style finesse jigs that people are throwing on spinning rods. And obviously it'd be kill it as a Ned Rig option too. And we all know smallmouth loves small little beavers, and this thing's probably going to get bit a whole bunch. So check out the little TRD bugs. The streaks. So these right here are, you know, I'm a fluke fisherman. I've always had a lot of confidence in fishing, that fluke style, soft jerk bait style bait. This one's made of elastic, so it's going to last you all day long. I think it's going to shine more on weighted presentations, like a drop shot or if you want to fish it on a, a, a like a small weighted Texas rig or jig head, fish it as a trailer behind a chatterbait, um, anything like that. They're going to last you, like I said, over and over with that elastic. They're going to last you all day long. And this color is a pretty good color too, if you know what I mean. Last up, the grubs. So being a smallmouth fisherman myself up here in the North Country, Grubs have always been something I've used a lot of. I use them for multi-species purposes, but especially for smallmouth fishing. And largemouth do eat them on the back of a swim jig as well. So uh, all having that advantage of being as durable as Z-Man plastics are, and some really cool colors too. That's a great motor oil option there. And this would be a great multi-species option for any of you anglers all over the country that are looking to just catch some dinner, not just tournament fishing. So. Meantime, all this stuff is on the site. Go check it out now and go catch it.